each person has a duty of his own, and for others, the one who fears the consequences of the duty, shies away from it. That's why Lord Krishna made the spiritual discourse Bhagavad Gita when the dejected warrior Arjuna refused to fight against his kick and pinned in the battlefield of Kurukshtra. The Gita became the guide for human life. Mistakes are natural and common when we do anything. That doesn't mean we should refrain from them. In an office, one person made very few mistakes as he hardly worked. Many people think they have done their duty to their parents by just sending money and providing all amenities to them. Undoubtedly, no one can remain idle at any point of time, because the human being is compelled by the nature to do some actions, even during sleep. Our heart and other internal systems keep functioning in tune with the surroundings, that's why we feel sweat and cold. According to Hinduism anyone performing his duties personal or social without caring for the results will get absolved of the effects arising from these duties. Such an individual is called a karma yogi and is destined to gain the blessings of God. Palaces, forts, skyscrapers, bridges, highways, etc. symbolize the dedication of many people who spent their energy and time for making memorable and useful objects of our life. Thanks to the hard work and sincerity of farmers, we get an uninterrupted supply of food to sustain us. A recent news item reported that some sniffer dogs spent a whole night with a king cobra in an airport kennel. Though these animals were trained to spot the narcotics, they didn't have an idea of how to sniff out the reptile. Nonetheless, the duty conscious canines were barking through the night to alert the lousy human guards. Human beings are bound to discharge their natural duties like rearing families, helping others and nurturing the flora and fauna in the surrounding nature. One cannot remain idle without doing these duties as the future birth is said to be linked to them. Further, it's a common belief that a person can reach God by discharging duties without minding their fruits. One that forgets the duty is called the robber, because he slash she leads an idle life without contributing anything to the world and actually living at the cost of others. Therefore, do not remain idle due to laziness or fear of responsibility accepting the times when you need to rest from work or convalescing from sickness. Work hard like a bill. Work without selfishness like our heart. People that realize and perform their duties will not fail in their efforts, but earn name and fame. God Krishna said I have neither duty nor expectations from all three worlds. Even then, I am always involved in my work. If I abstain from my duty, great chaos will prevail. The humans which look to me as their path will suffer heavily. So I should stay in my duty to set an example.